Good morning students. So a lot of students are very much confused about what to study, what not to study, from where to prepare for the exams and uh, what about the subjects like uh, cultural studies, what about the subjects like Indian literature. Okay, so one of the things I want to share is that if uh, whatever I am saying, okay, whatever other YouTubers are saying, whatever other teachers or whatever other educators, including me, we are saying that you have to cover this topic, you have to cover that topic, please confirm it first by going through the previous year questions, okay, many times it happens that just to impress you, coin some topics, coin some books that UGC has not asked in the last five years or in the last 10 years, okay, one time there was a question in the examination and based on that an educator including me i'm not just blaming other educators also okay i'm not blaming other educators including me we sometimes uh, tell you like you have to study this thing just to instill the emotions of fear so that you can join the coachings of teachers so that you can join the coachings of limitless literature okay i'm just i'm also putting myself into this so that no others can also get offended it happens uh, like just to make yourself feel grandeur we just go on to give some works that no one has listened and you think that yes this is the only teacher who can teach us something because these are the works that no other teachers are talking about but it does not happen no one can find the right answer do not stress about these questions just skip these questions and you do not have to study collaborator, garden of solitude, role of honor, the half of mother. If they are asking one question in 20 years, what is the use of studying these things? But I can take admissions by saying that have you studied the collaborator? Have you studied the garden of solitude, role of honor? You have to study this. You have not studied. I will teach you in the coaching class. Join me. I will tell you. <laughs> that happens. Uh, use your brain. Use your mind. You have given the brain between the two ears. Use it. I also do not know the answer, the collaborator, the garden of solitude, no one knows the answer and you don't have to study. Okay, uh, teachers are saying Indian literature, Indian literature, Indian literature, you do not have to study. Most of the questions, most of the topics are repeated from the previous year and if teacher is saying that you have to study this thing, if you have to study that thing, just confirm it. Do not simply rely on that teacher. Sometimes it happens due to greed, due to admissions. We make things grandeur, we make things big enough so that it will look like impossible task without the help of teacher to crack this examination, okay? Uh, please, first of all, confirm it from uh, the previous year question, whether that to particular topic has been asked in the last 10 years. If that topic is asked one time, then you do not have to study that particular topic okay like there are 3000 topic wise question booklet that we provide to the students so basically we can say that there are 3000 questions 3000 topics in those topics you have to study only those topics that are repeated again and again another thing i want to share is that if you are a general category student i have already shared it you have to get 35 questions right out of 100 questions in english literature if you know 35 questions then you can crack this examination rest of the 25 questions can easily be corrected through uh, the intelligent guesswork through just doing the blind shot C, 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 A, B, C, A, B, C, D, C, D, C, C, D, okay, whatever options that you can write. 30 to 35 questions, you must definitely know the answer of that you are very much confident about. For SCST category students, you have to study only for 20 to 25 questions. Rest of the questions will definitely get correct. British theory criticism, you have to study from basic to intermediate level of knowledge, you have to develop by subscribing to any course. Uh, you can study the William J. Long, whatever book you can refer, you can develop the basic understanding of these subjects. After building the foundation of these three subjects, then you can study the previous year questions. Okay. And now uh, I will take you to the December 2023 question paper and I will show you how to study. Okay. I will analyze that question paper and I will also tell you how many times that question have been already been asked in the previous 10 years or 15 years. Okay. Let's look at the screen now. All right. So this is the first question, sons and lovers. D.H. Lawrence, Sons and Lovers. I will not check out the options. What I am basically telling you is that there is a question on D.H. Lawrence, Sons and Lovers. And if you pick up the previous 10 years of papers on D.H. Lawrence and that you can visit on the Limitless Literature website, you can also check out the hard copy of that. We will be delivering it to your doorstep 
with the free deliveries available all right so you can confirm it by going through these 3000 plus previous year questions how many times this particular work has been asked dh lawrence sons and lovers if you just check the previous year questions more than seven to eight times this particular work has been asked you have to study this topic in particular depth because five times this particular work has already been in the asked in the examination if you just allow me to show you all the hundred questions i will show you how they are asking from where they are asking okay let's move on to the next question here we have portmanteau morphine these are the four options and almost three to four times portmanteau morphine has already been asked in the examination they have already asked what are the examples of portmanteau morphine there are other kind of morphines also zero morphine okay so that is also an example of morphine they're asking the definition of morphology okay brunch that is an example of portmanteau morphine breakfast plus lunch that is portmanteau morphine and it comes from lewis carroll's uh, work looking in the glass alice in the wonderland he has invented this technique bollywood that is bombay plus hollywood bollywood everything is there already there in the previous year 20 years of topics but you have to uh, get a good command on these subjects okay the portmanteau morphine is from language and linguistics subject all right let's move on to the next one you see there is a poem skylark the skylark badger gypsum camp first love okay on the looking at the skylark we can figure out what is the right answer you cannot just take british literature for granted do not ask me in british literature so what to study which work is important everything is important in british literature okay there will be 35 questions so if you just get 20 questions right out of 35 questions that will make 50 percent of your work okay let's move on to the next one you see this is a question on cultural studies if you deeply look at this question you will just simply figure out that this question is just based on your common sense do not make cultural studies a hype or cultural studies cultural studies they will not ask you something very different from cultural studies they are asking just shown basic understanding common sense there are not more than three or four writers in cultural studies that is different thing if a teacher is telling you to study this study this but why to study those things that has never been asked in the last 10 years i can give you 30 writers in cultural studies but what is the use of studying that 30 writers okay they are always asking raymond williams stephen greenblatt instead of putting all your efforts on cultural studies okay give it to something that you already know you do not know about cultural studies that's fine but the previous question was on pb shelley have you studied all the poems that is mentioned in that options do not worry about the uncertainties the study does what are certain what is there in the previous year question and that you have to build the command on that okay let's look at the next question she stoops to conquer i have told 50 to 100 times to my students who are in the batch that watch the movies on street stoops to conquer because there was a passage also in the previous year and five to six questions were there from this she stoops to conquer okay many times they have asked let's look on to the next question name the poet who has composed the following poems okay divine image the little boy lost the little boy found samuel johnson's william collins william blake william shakespeare now as i already told you that you have to study british literature in thoroughly and now based on the common sense you can also solve these questions like there are four examples the little boy lost the little boy found the divine image so uh, there is some sort of spirituality in these titles the divine image and the holy thursday and looking at the four options if you know about william shakespeare william shakespeare do not write such spiritual works okay samuel johnson i don't think that he has written any work that is purely understandable what is the right option if you even did not have studied these four poems you can figure out that these works are from william blake just based on the common sense you can answer these questions let's look on to the next one sharan kumar limbale argues that dalit literature is unique because now sharan kumar limbale okay so in the gate examination three times this particular work has already been asked okay that is the advantage of studying the previous year questions if they ask any time on this particular topic i can 100 percent answer this question because in the gate examination iit's 2021 sample paper dalit literature the aesthetics of uh, dalit literature by sharon kumar limble was asked 2021 sample paper by iit 2021 final exam the same work has been asked in the february exam 2021 check out the previous year gate examination and you will find this particular work over there that's the advantage of looking at previous year questions and we have already discussed seven questions and in these seven questions i found nothing outside 
the last 10 years or 20 years of previous year questions. Do not just simply rely on my word as I told you that we educators tend to take the admissions from the students and we just make them feel fearful that it is impossible for you to crack this examination without my help, without the help of educators. I try my best to give you the transparent information but I have seen many teachers doing these things like they are putting some gimmick, some um, obscure words, some works that they have already not studied but they are just putting into the YouTube videos just to make an impression on you. That's wrong. Okay, uh, let's look on to the next question. Hyperbole, metonymy, okay, that's very basic question. You have to study the figure of speech. Nothing new is here. Waiting for Mahatma, so many hunger, sword and sickle, distant drum. Nothing new is there. That's a very basic question. If you just have done your BA, graduation in English, you know the answer of this. Very easy. Arkhana and waiting for Mahatma. Next is Anna Karenina. Almost 10 times this particular work has asked Anna Karenina. I have watched the movie and that's that has done the maximum work because if there is any question from Anna Karenina I can easily answer that based on the understanding of the topic okay almost 10 questions we have discussed and nothing came outside of the previous 10 years or 20 years of papers okay let's look on the next one Gals deluge it is really easy basic question minor literature according to Riley's and this particular topic we have discussed in our study material also from where these topics are coming in the study material you see 90 percent of our material is based on the previous year questions like uh, last 20 years of previous year questions everything is discussed in the material that we are providing to the students so we have already put that topic in our material that means this topic has already been there in the last 10 years again and again and again over again in the last 20 years these topics were there in the previous year so our material is not like thick academic books it is very concise and only based on the previous year questions so that you do not have to study extra so we have this misconjunction creole indian tribal people mulatto australian indigenous population is termed as red indians that is also a logical question i also have heard about two or three terms in these four to five options basically it is all about intelligent guesswork a and e b and c creole you might have studied okay that is the right answer so we can eliminate two options just in within a second so either the right answer is 2 b and c or the right answer can be b and d so 50 50 chance that i will get the answer right so i will just blind shot 2 and 4 i will just mark the b option right or i will just mark the d option right or i will just read what is there in the c option what is there in the d option indian tribal people and mulatto i do not know about mulatto anyone who has been studying literature for years might be they have read this particular term somewhere but it is uh, not uh, really easy to figure out what they are asking so we have just chance 50 50 chance but what my point is here is that they have already asked creole in the last 10 years 12 years many times five times six times so that is the basic thing that i am trying to tell you you have to rely on the previous year only after developing the command or the basics of uh, british theory and criticism and then you can start analyzing the previous year question based on the uh, these topics okay let's look at the other question which among the following writers remarked that i know of no more encouraging effect than the unquestionable ability of man to elevate his life by a conscious endeavor a man with ability can elevate his standard of living by doing the conscious effort okay there are four options henry david thoreau ralph waldo emerson henry james emily dixon okay i also do not know the answer of this question so uh, what i can do is these motivational sort of things are spoken by uh, like the american writers ralph waldo emerson yeah henry david thoreau and these two henry james and emily dixon uh, never talk about these such type of uh, statements never talk about the motivational speech or self-improvement things so either the answer can be one or either the answer can be two so based on these two i can just go for the 50 50 shot and i can take the risk and i will just go by henry david thoreau because he is such a man who used to live in a forest uh, for many years and uh, he has also inspired emerson emerson has also inspired thoreau so i will just go with henry david thoreau okay a 50 50 chance no one can tell you the exact answer 
but the uh, if the answer goes in your favor that's one point extra okay 50 50 so i have studied ralph waldo emerson and he has only talked about such things in his one of the essays on nature he was a sort of spiritual person not a motivational man sort, sort of spiritual person over soul those sort of things he was used to talk about so based on the personality also you can answer the question for example william blake uh, was a spiritual person that i had just discussed based on the personality of the authors you can answer these questions i have not studied this statement but i think handy david thoreau is the right answer because sort of motivational speech he is talking about that's the advantage of studying the authors also knowing them personally on personal level okay so that's a question the questions new historicist reading of the lit literature okay there is no 100 percent surety that you can get the right answer uh, but again, also in the past 20 years, the new historicists have been asked again and again and again. Meta narratives were there in the previous year many times in in the past. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. Kamala Das. It's been asked thousand times in the past. Okay, Handmaid's Tale thousand times. Things fall apart. 1984 thousand times they have asked in the previous year questions. Raymond Williams. I have already discussed that they are asking. Uh, only Raymond Williams or two, three writers in the cultural studies, even though I can also give you many, many writers, many, many theorists. Uh, but you try to understand these things, no? Like, dude, you cannot study everything and you have to be very conscious about uh, all the efforts you are doing. They are asking five questions or six questions from cultural studies. They all are asking logical questions. But on the name of cultural studies, Oh, teachers are getting admissions of the students. I will teach you cultural studies. Have you read this in the cultural studies? Have you done this in the cultural studies? Okay, uh, that's not a right way. Confirm what teacher, what I am speaking to you in this video, do confirm it. Check out the previous year question, whether I am telling you the truth or I am telling you the lie. If I am telling you the lie, unsubscribe me, never listen to me. Do not make the things complex, it's very simple. Okay, Raymond Williams, you have already seen two questions and one question on cultural studies that is purely um, basic level question so we have discussed almost 20 questions okay you just uh, look at the another question aspects of the novel of em foster now looking at the option you will see uh, that's a difficult question but em foster was there in the last 10 years five to six times you have to study aspects of the novel if you have not studied this particular work in detail then there is no use of studying literature 10 to 15 times there is a question so almost 20 questions we have discussed and only one question that is out of the syllabus the rest 19 questions already there in the previous year questions as you move on and on you will find 70 questions 60 to 70 questions that have already been in the previous year and you just grab that 50 to 60 questions and rest of the questions you can just do the blind shots so these are all the things i want to share with you in this video if you want to know more about our books and courses just visit limitless literature because that also helps me to continue my work on youtube and all these things that i have already discussed make a note of it and study accordingly so that's it for this thank you we'll see you soon